This tutorial will cover the basics of Ricochet POS. If you have any questions or would like to schedule a one-on-one -on -one demo, then give us a call at 208-209-6697. Start out by going to the product section in the navigation bar and clicking once. Now in the upper right hand corner of the screen, click new item to add a new item into inventory. Start out by adding a product name, short description, and category. You can add categories to the software by either going to the product section under preferences or by clicking the orange plus sign to create a category on the fly. You can add any product notes or add a photo to an item, then add a price, record your cost, update quantity, or set a low stock threshold. You can add a pre-existing SKU or barcode into the UPC field, then hit save to save the item. You can click add new item or click back to products to go back to the product list. If you are attaching variants to an item like size or color, you will need to create the variant first in the product preferences section. Go to Preferences, then to Products, then click the Attributes tab. Click the orange plus sign, give the attribute list a name, then add each attribute option, separating them by comma. Remember you can always come back and add additional attributes or reorganize the list. Go back to the product section and click Add New Item. You can toggle the Has Variants toggle button on to add a product with variants. Add the same info before, like name and category. Then choose your attribute list. You can remove the option by clicking the red X or add a second variant by clicking the plus sign. Now choose the attribute values you want to attach to the item. You can add a price and quantity and click the drop down arrow to add additional info like cost and low stock threshold. Click save to save the item. You can click print label from inside this screen to print this item's label or click back to products, check the boxes next to the items you want to print labels for, then click print labels. To ring up a sale the POS screen, scan an item into the sale or search for it by name. You can also add an item that has not been pre-inventoried to a sale by clicking Manual Sale and adding the necessary info. You can add or subtract to an item's quantity, add a line item discount, or turn off the sales tax. You also can add a discount to the entire sale by clicking the plus sign next to Transaction Discounts and add any notes to the sale. To run a simple cash transaction, add the amount you're taking from the customer into the Payment Amount field, then hit Cash. You will see a line item for the tender used and the change due. Click the X next to any line item to clear them from the sale. If you would like to run a credit card sale, click the credit card tender type. And to run credit cards through Ricochet, you will need to be using Gravity Payments as your merchant service. You can add a customer to the sale to track sales history or email receipts. And to create a new customer, click the orange plus sign and add any available information. Click Finish to finish the sale and print or email a receipt. Now you can go to the report section then to the sales detail or summary report to review your sales information. 